Welcome back to my channel where I give health information on poultry farming for beginners in poultry farming, backyard keepers, small scale poultry farmers, and poultry farmers in general. Plus, how to do organic poultry farming in the right to how to use natural products for your chickens. Okay, so I've been a while I posted on this channel. I want to thank my subscribers, especially for having patience. If this is your first time visiting my channel, please endeavor to subscribe because you are not going to regret it. You are going to enjoy information that comes from this video, especially those interested in organic poultry farming, so that it's small scale poultry farmers. Okay, now on today's video, I have a special package for you how to combine spices. Many persons, so some of you have been asking, Ah, oh, Mr. Sam, how can I combine spices together? Can I use this spice and this spice? In what ratio? In what amount? And I say sometime that you should wait, that there is a particular ratio you have to use and how to make research on some of this. And the three spices I have made research on today that you can use to increase body weight of your brother's chick, they are one, garlic, black pepper and red pepper. Let us quickly just summarize some of these uh, benefits in using these spices. Of course, garlic is the chief alternative for synthetic drugs, synthetic and Antibiotics. Garlic is the most researched herbs or spices that have shown to, you know, you know ward off bacteria, ward off uh, red mites, parasites, and chicken, increase the immune system, strengthen the immune system of chicken. I cannot overemphasize it here. You can check the link where I you can check the link above or in my description where you see or learn how to use garlic for chicken effectively. Full video. Okay. Now the other two. Uh, black pepper and red pepper. Black pepper serve as a, a dewormer for your chicken. It strengthens the immune system of a lot of um, bacteria and they also serve as a dewormer. And secondly, they have antioxidants which is very useful. Now, red pepper contains carotene or carotenoids, as so many of them, that helps to enhance the yellow color of your chicken yolk, puts this yellowish texture to your chicken meat. Okay, now how can you use this red, this combined spices for your chicken? The research done so that many treatments were used. They use normal feed for the chicken. They have a treatment for normal feed. Feed. They have treatment for garlic. They have black pepper. They have treatment for red pepper as well. Then the fifth treatment was treatment where this chicken, where these spices were combined together in the ratio of, ratio of one ratio one ratio one ratio one. Okay. Now at the end, the total measure gave 0.5 gram. To 100 grams of feed, and they found out that at the end of six weeks, the weight of the final body weight of the chicken increased compared to others. Secondly, feed conversion ratio increased as well compared to others. Not that others are not good, the, the, the result was, was significant, more significant in this combined mis ratio. Okay, now, secondly, thirdly, they found out that the fats, the fats, the cholesterol went down, triglycerides went down the low density lipoprotein which is the bad fat went down the, then the good fat that is high density lipoprotein went up so it's over overall it is very good now this shows that that your chicken will have low incident of heart attack stroke or sudden death syndrome in your chicken such incident will reduce in your brothers especially brother chickens okay now how can you use this One kg bag of uh, feed, no, or you can put into 25 kg bag of feed that you miss then serve to your chicken to enjoy okay if you find this content helpful please endeavor to subscribe share and like as i promise i'll be consistent from henceforth at least one video in a week you know if i have more time i'll increase it that will not be easy for me attending to other things as a teacher I teach my students I attend to my bed and other consultant issue I have around but I'll be trying to put more video on this channel so if you have any question leave it on the comment box below 
if you want any spices you want me to research on maybe that is abundant in your area that you don't know whether this spices is harmful or this root is harmful or the vegetable is harmful please let me know so that i can do justice to that and do some research on, on that as well and share it for everyone to see because everybody have spices or root that are abundant in different areas around the world okay just share it with us so that we can do the session on it and people can benefit as well so see you on my next video just click on the next video bye bye